Welcome back to another exciting episode of The Critics Hub. Today, we're going to deep dive into Mobile Suit Gundam The Witch from Mercury Season 2, Episode 2. <laughs> Your applause is uh, a bit in place. So sit back, relax, and hit subscribe. And um, before we uh, get to the review itself, please like and share this video. Salamat. E ano ba nga ba? E hindi ko na kayo patutupik-tupikin pa. Let's get to the nitty-gritty of this one. Face! Ewan ko ba? Some of you may, um, may realize it had a slow pacing from the start, pero... <clears throat> from the moment uh, Sophie reminded Suleta of, uh, of her challenge to... Uh, of her challenge to her... Ay, mako. There's a there's a certain air of tenseness, of tension, uh, from that moment onwards. So do I have complaints? Nope. Kasi yung mga sumunod na events dito talagang bakbak ang umati ka bune. So that uh, that uh, that particular sequence that triggered the tense pacing of this episode, yeah, it was it was well placed. Okay. Uh, that was that's my um that's why that's my minimum observation of it guys from from that point onwards wala na you can cut the air with a knife flow naman the one and only gear ship hey okay? you can disagree with me on this guys right if you got disagreements with me right there comment section was when Ariel started acting on its own in combat again pero it's an entirely different scenario eh. Uh, as if Ariel obliged to the death wish uh, Sophie is, was exhibiting in this sequence. Well, for me, that's a no-brainer of a gear shift post. Because the way I see it, this is the gear shift that will shape season 2. Okay? From, uh, from how uh, the external characters would, uh, would deal with Ariel and Soleta, down to Soleta's own mindset. Okay? Mabigat ang gearship na to. Although this is only one gearship, guys, do not rely on it to tell you the whole episode. Watch it from start to finish. Because you'll be missing out on the action sequences, alright? Plot-wise. <clears throat> La, talagang tuloy-tuloy yung... Uh, yung... The plot of story, eh. not even an explainer. I don't think you would call. Well, um, the little side story that was happening when uh, when Ariel started um uh, went autonomous again, so to speak. Pero iba yung circumstances dito, eh. Na kung saan inexplain ni Prospera. Na oh, it was a really revealing side story. Pero, nonetheless, it's a side story. Pero, if you look at, if you, um, if you deep dive into it, that side story, nagmumukhang explainer na eh. If you, if you, if you would watch it very thoroughly, it would, it would, uh, it would slowly pass off as an explainer. Therefore, Malinis ang plot, guys. I need to break it to you, guys. Hindi plansado ng plot to. Malinis na plot. Because, uh, because of the evolution that uh, supposed side story took, umpisa ka, alam mo, side story. But as Prospera was, uh, was telling her story, it slowly developed into an explainer sequence. Kung mga nag-evolve yung sequence na yun. You can say it's a uh, superbly clean plot, but if you beg to differ, there's the comment section. Okay, guys, comment below your thoughts. So, pace, flow, and plot. You okay, I'm to go for this um for episode two of The Witch from Mercury season two, guys. All right, talagang yeah, The Witch from Mercury and I'm So, 
Mobile Suit Gundam The Witch from Mercury Season 2 Episode 2 Absolute No Brainer Last order of business The thumbnail I think this um uh, This sequence is quite self-explanatory to you Especially If you're a long time Gundam fan This was the very Exact moment when Ariel was well was about to put Sophie out of her misery. Yung asin talaga ng papatay na niya rito. Uh, it's about to deliver the killing blow. Pero uh, right after this, biglang inawat siya ni Suleta. Eh, well, uh, if you if you ask me, Suleta should have let Ariel go. <laughs> eh, kasi. Namatay tuloy si Sophie uh, due to her extreme euphoria. Kasi talagang lunod na lunod na sa yung tinatawag nilang Gundam Curse. Eh, eventually, siguro nag, nag-convulsion. Eh, well, she actually vomited inside her helmet. Eh, if, you've seen that, uh, if you've seen that sequence, yeah, she actually puked in her helmet. So, Wow. That was a disturbing sequence. But this one, sayang. <laughs> Sana tinululo na lang eh. Right? Uh, there's, there, there won't be anything wrong with that because uh, you just euthanize the person. You, you're gonna literally put the person out of his misery, out of his, uh, out of her misery. Right? And, well, just goes to show you that um, up to now, well, wala pa talaga sariling killer instinct si Suleta. Pero si Ariel, meron na. And, uh, and if you've seen the episode already, you now know why uh, Ariel has these tendencies of um, becoming autonomous in the heat of battle. We're going to, uh, we're, gonna, we're still gonna keep tabs on this, uh, on this, on this, on season two of The Witch from Mercury, guys, right? This was a really good episode. It deserved the two thumbs up. In the meantime, watch the other reviews on this page, okay? And Daniel, which from Mercury Season 2 isn't the only anime in this roster?